What does it take to become a successful leader, to make your dreams a reality? These are questions that have puzzled many of us. Today, we delve into the wisdom of a timeless classic, Napoleon Hill's Think and Grow Rich, a book that has been a beacon of inspiration for countless leaders and achievers across the globe. This book isn't just about financial wealth, it's a manual for personal growth, a blueprint for success that transcends the material. It explores the power of desire, the importance of faith, the role of the subconscious mind, and so much more. It's about understanding how to harness your inner resources and channel them towards the achievement of your goals. My journey through this book has been transformative and it has imparted lessons that have reshaped my approach to leadership. So, are you ready to embark on this journey of discovery with me? Join me as we explore the essential lessons from this timeless classic that transformed my leadership. The journey begins with desire, the starting point of all achievement. A burning desire is more than a mere wish or a simple want. It's a pulsating, deeply rooted craving that propels us forward, kindling the spark of determination and resilience. It's the fuel that powers the engine of achievement, transforming lofty dreams into tangible reality. Consider the leaders who have made their mark in history. Each of them harbored an intense desire, a passion that transcended the ordinary, igniting their journey towards extraordinary feats. Their burning desire was not just a fleeting emotion, but a constant, unyielding force that guided their actions and decisions. So how can you, as a leader, harness this powerful tool in your journey? It starts with identifying your passion, that one thing that keeps you awake at night, your raison d'etre. Nurture it, feed it, let it grow until it becomes a burning desire. Remember, without a burning desire, our dreams remain just that, dreams. Believe in your attainment of desire and influence your subconscious mind. This line is more than a mere suggestion. It's a powerful principle that has the potential to transform your leadership. Faith, the visualization of and belief in the attainment of desire is a fundamental cornerstone of achieving your goals. It's the unshakable conviction that you can and will succeed. Now let's talk about auto-suggestion. It's not just a fancy term. It's a mechanism for influencing your subconscious mind. Picture it as a tool that enables you to program your mind towards the attainment of your goals. It's like setting a GPS for your mind, steering you towards your destination. When these two concepts, faith and auto-suggestion, are intertwined, they become a powerful force in effective leadership. Leaders who have faith in their abilities and use auto-suggestion to instill this belief in their subconscious mind are often more successful in inspiring and guiding their teams. Believe in your ability to lead and you are halfway there. Knowledge is power, but without imagination, it's like a bird without wings. Let's talk about specialized knowledge first. It's the kind of knowledge you gain from personal experiences or observations. Instead of being a jack of all trades, you focus on one area, becoming an expert in that field. This mastery can give you an edge, and as a leader, it can command respect and inspire trust. However, specialized knowledge alone isn't enough. You need the power of imagination. Imagination is the workshop of the mind. It's where you take your specialized knowledge and dream up new ideas, new possibilities. It's where you visualize your success and how to achieve it. Imagination allows you to see beyond the present, to envision a future where your desires have been realized. When paired together, specialized knowledge and imagination become a formidable tool for success. Leadership requires not only knowledge but also the imagination to see beyond the present. A dream without a plan is just a wish. Add to it the mastery of procrastination and you have the perfect recipe for success. In the journey of achievement, organized planning is the compass that guides us towards our goals. It's where we take our vivid desires and give them form, breaking them down into actionable steps. But planning alone isn't enough. It must be coupled with swift and decisive action. In the realm of leadership, this becomes even more crucial. Leaders are the architects of their team's success. They sketch the blueprint of their vision and then guide their team to bring it to life. But a leader's role doesn't end at planning. They must also make decisive decisions, cutting through the fog of uncertainty with the sharp blade of resolution. Decisiveness is the antidote to procrastination. It's not about making the right decision every time, but about making a decision and then making it right. Great leaders don't just dream, they plan and they act decisively. Persistence is the key to success, but remember no one succeeds alone. 
Napoleon Hill in his transformative book Think and Grow Rich underscores the importance of persistence. It's the sustained effort necessary to induce faith to keep moving forward even when the path is steep. In leadership, this translates to resilience, an undeterred spirit that refuses to back down in the face of adversity. But Hill doesn't stop there. He introduces the concept of the mastermind. It's about the power of collective minds, the synergy of combined intellect that surpasses any individual brilliance. As leaders, we must foster this collaborative environment, harnessing the collective intelligence to drive our vision forward. Then we delve into the subconscious mind, the hidden powerhouse of our thoughts and actions. This unseen force can be our greatest ally or our worst enemy. As leaders, we can use it to our advantage, shaping it with positive affirmations and targeted goals. A leader is persistent, harnesses the power of collective minds, and uses the subconscious mind to their advantage. Our brain is a broadcasting and receiving station for thought and our sixth sense, the door to the temple of wisdom. This powerful metaphor encapsulates the essence of our intellectual and intuitive capabilities. Our brain, constantly transmitting and picking up signals, serves as a conduit for our thoughts, ideas, and desires. It's the engine that drives our ambition and the catalyst that transforms our dreams into reality. Meanwhile, our sixth sense, our intuition, guides us through the labyrinth of life. It's our internal compass, pointing us towards opportunities, steering us away from pitfalls, and leading us down the path to success. From Think and Grow Rich, we glean three key accountability lessons. The importance of desire, the power of faith, and the need for persistence. These, along with three leadership takeaways, specialized knowledge, organized planning, and mastering procrastination, are the stepping stones on our journey to success. In the journey of leadership, remember your brain is your greatest asset and your intuition, your guiding light.